Hey, what's going on guys? Jolts here, back with another item guide, and today we're going to be going over the purple unique, Seleki's Protocol. This sniper is extremely strong, and yeah, let's go ahead and jump into the video and show you how to get it. Alright, side mission. Proof of wife. You know, I've noticed this mission is in three locations. Here, here, and over here. So I guess you can pick it up at three different locations if you want to. So yeah, let's do it. Also, the mission is found at Lectra City in one of these three locations. Uh, this is the one I picked it up at. Okay, so we need to head to the subway and save somebody. Oh, we cool? No, we're not cool. Click. Alright, so one of the bandits are holding an Atlas soldier prisoner. And in order to save her, I gotta save one of their bandits and trade them off. Alright, they're not happy. Let's free Bloodshine. There she is. Oh. No, she blew up. Uh, so how do we make the exchange if she's dead? Alright, because their prisoner died, I think we're gonna trick them into making the exchange. So I gotta find my way back there. Okay, we'll put the mask on you. Are they falling for it? I guess that worked. Alright, cool. Well, we're killing the family reunion. Wasn't part of the plan. There she is. Oh, we got a rare purple sniper. So Lucky's protocol. Cut Katagawa's junior's junior. All right. Uh, Katagawa is the president for Malawan, in case you're wondering. 15% reload speed and two times weapon zoom. That's a cool looking gun. I like it. Look at the barrel, man. It's so wide. It looks like a COV though, with the red and the kind of rusting going on with it. So what do you do? It bounces? Oh, hold on. Let's get some more room. So we have protocol 1.y, protocol 1.x. Oh, it shoots out multi pellets, five of them, and they bounce. So one, two, they impact on three. And then the other one is. Oh, I see. It's vertical. All right, we have more room finally. Okay, so X is going to be horizontal, and Y is vertical. That's super cool. And it doesn't split until it impacts. So if you play Borderlands 2, you might be familiar with the Fiver, uh, in which when you shoot the ground, you can split the pellet. It's basically that, but on a sniper. Uh, if we're going to be fighting these dudes, they're more, I guess, vertical. So I want to go to Y, and I shoot the floor. I missed. <laughs> so you don't want to aim dead on, huh? I mean, you can, but less damage. Yeah, there you go. So if you get it just right, you can hit all the pellets and hit really hard. Come here, you. Wow. And it's got a 14 mag. That's huge. One ammo per shot. All right. So I've been messing with it for a little bit, and the trick is to aim low at the feet. Uh, like at the ground and a little bit back not all the way in front of the enemy so like right here and you can hit most of the pellets it might be my new favorite weapon okay i'm done i'm done so final thoughts on the weapon it's good it's good it's the fibber returning as a sniper big mag size good damage uh decent reload i guess the only complaint if i had to like pick something would be it's only shock but that's fair. That is a fair trade-off. Yeah, I would say definitely pick it up and try it out for yourself. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And of course, if you did, please be sure to leave a like because that'd be awesome. And if you really liked the video, be sure to sub. And yeah, you guys have a great day and I will see you all later. Peace out.